It's going to be another good auction. I saw watercolor by uh, Peggy Thatch Sibley. Neat uh, decorated pieces to the trade only back in the 80s. <clears throat> really cool coat rack. Nice 1960s furniture out of a house. A lot of it is um, century. There's a whole bunch of the original paperwork, receipts, all kinds of interesting stuff with it. Collection of rug beaters. There are a lot of rugs in this auction. You know, tribal Navajo type like this. Big room size decorator, oriental, newer contemporary pieces. All kinds of goodies in the auction. Another carved book, coffee table. This time with the American Eagle, it's a much better. You know, people like that one a lot more. Several neat pillows. Another Indian rug. This is a cool coffee table. Uh, drawer pulls out, real industrial. It's uh, probably a store display. Would it be great for your home or your loft? More rugs. Neat little buggy seat. And this rug here is actually a bag. A Baluchi Afghan storage bag. Pretty neat piece. Nice oak table and chairs. Another rug. A couple more rugs. Nice horse engraving etching. Nice contemporary chandelier. Very decorative. Wash stand. Really cool. New, newer rug. Check out the old medicine cabinet. Really nice Windsor back arm. Continuous arm Windsor back. Really neat iron coat rack. Old paint. Interesting old pictures. Love the glass where the uh, <laughs> glass were there and the neat set there and scoop of little Nambe pieces. And here's the nice uh, 1960s bedroom set. Nice uh, dresser with the mirror, high boy chest, and a bed that matches. Interesting pictures. Those are uh, old, I think, Santa Fe Railroad uh, countertops framed up. This is a cool rug, Turkish probably, and really big. As you can see, that's the you know nice you know, the whole bed and the dresser with the mirrors on the length of it. Some paintings, nice mirror, some fireplace stuff. Another rug, really nice Ethan Allen type uh, china hutch there. And then there's uh, several partial sets of beam Lennox plates here. Edward Marshall beam design. A neat little set here with the owl. I think it's all owls in this set. Owl plate collection. Nice table and six chairs. There are two full size leaves, and then I believe there are two half leaves. Where'd they go? Hmm. Oh, there they are on the table. Chairs over here. And these are originally cut this half size, so you can really have a versatile table. And a nice big set of Dansk Blue Mist. Pretty high, pretty uh, desirable set here, folks. Check out your replacements, prices, and everything else. Nice uh, decorative pieces, cool mirror. Really big old bevel mirror. Another Ariana rug. Great little set of scales. Couple of wheels. I like the ice cream chair style shoe shine stand. Really cool piece. You don't see many of those around. A few stacks of pictures back here. Some pretty interesting looking work though. Like the Wonder Bread sign. The Michelob sign does light up, which is not a cord strung to it yet. Olympia Beer sign obviously lights up. Really nice screen. Asian lacquer. Rattan set's pretty nice. Here's another uh, table, a coffee table and end table that matches. From that same mistake from the living room and dining room furniture. And bedroom furniture, actually, I'm sorry. Big drop. I love the cute little kid stuff on top. The rocking horse, the little tin buggy, and the uh, little wicker. Good 1920s you know, or 30s 
The child size Wicked Rock is really super cute. Oh, there's some interesting artwork here. This painting right here um, is Ben Musa Fatih Fatiha. Is, uh, you Google his name, you'll find he's uh, pretty well, you know, people know his work. Some engravings, some nice lights, pictures there. And this rug, make sure you look at it twice, there's a lot going on in there. There's like a several Persian images of, uh, you know, riot horses, you know, riders on horses and dogs and I thought I've never seen elephants or something, lions. All kinds of interesting stuff going on. They're kind of hard to see in a picture, but trust me, it is there. More rugs. Really pretty rug there. And this is a beautiful piece. It's a rope, a four-poster rope bed with the canopy and the skirt. I mean, it's just a really pretty piece. Very pretty piece. Some interesting blankets over here, including a Pullman. The Pullman Company blanket there. Oh, just some old blankets, some quilts, a wedding dress, a couple of neat trunks. And they are full of tools. Make sure I grab the right side. Wrenches and planes and this one has a few levels in it. Just a couple more below there, a couple big ones. And then the auction wraps up. You see we have some interesting pieces here, some pottery, little pegs or something, a bunch of old buttons, a little electric base, some old baseball bats, looks like a Royals, seven up Royals crown. This is honestly a rocket fuel handler suit. And it appears to be complete. Um, <laughs> probably make a really U.S. Air Force. It would probably make a pretty cool uh, Halloween costume. That's only a couple weeks away, so. The Roseville teapot is missing the lid. This piece has got a chip, so I'll we'll sell those three together at the end. Another clock. Some neat eyes and ends, some lamps. I like the John Deere lawn sprinkler, that's pretty cute. Bunch of sewing stuff here. A couple little pellet, you know, air pellet guns there. We did find in one of the boxes a uh, Seabus piece that's in the front of the auction. I'll make sure I pinch on that at the end of paper mache clown collection. Some light fixtures, some more lamps. Here's a cool 60s or 70s painting. Pretty neat deal. So folks, we have a really good group of stuff back here in the back. A lot of rugs. And a lot of rugs for this for this auction. Some nice furniture, some neat looking pieces, some good usable pieces. Um, good quality, good condition pretty much throughout. So I've got this little wallet table here. It's just a beautiful little inlay piece right there. Like the little candlesticks below as well. Make sure you look around, even though they're not as full as they used to be, we still kind of we display stuff as if it was in your home, so sometimes there's things that may not jump right out at you, but are pretty neat and need to be found out and sought out and take advantage of that. Alrighty, see you on Tuesday.